Okay guys, there's an issue with these Pontiac Grand Ams. There was actually a recall on the ignition switch. Um, and <laughs> believe it or not, most commonly the problem is um, what we do to them. So if you look here, this is my son's car. Here's his key. There's nothing hanging on it. Why? Because these ignition switches are known to go bad because of weight. If you have a bunch of stuff hanging off the back of the key, it puts pressure on the key while it's in the ignition and it screws up the tumbler. So uh, if you do have that problem, you're going to have an alarm system light that comes on. And here's how you can clear it. There's a couple different ways. One way is to turn the key on to the accessory and wait about 10 minutes and turn it off and then turn it on again. Do that three times. And when you turn it off, only leave it off for about 10, 15 seconds. Um, that's one way to clear it. The other way is to just pull off a cable and uh, that will reset the code inside the computer as well. If you want a temporary fix for it before you change the ignition switch, because that really is the problem, you can get this uh, electric parts cleaner here and just spray a little bit right inside there. So it's gummed up a little bit because of that pressure from that key going in and hanging down because of all the stuff that we hang off of our keys on our keychain and such. Um, it, it wears away at the metal in there. And so when it wears away, it kind of files it down a little bit. That falls inside the ignition and that makes it harder. So by spraying this stuff in there, it cleans it out a little bit. Don't overload it. It is electrical uh, inside of there, but this is an electrical spray. So don't overload it in there. You only want to do about that much. Maybe not even that, really. That came out quick. About that much. That's all it should take to clean it up. But uh, if it doesn't start and that security light is on, you can also turn the key on and leave it on until your ignition light comes on. If the ignition light comes on, it will start. But uh, if you don't want to wait for that and you don't, want, you don't have the 30 minutes to waste or such, just pull a cable off and wait about 15 seconds and put it back on. That will also reset the ECM. So I hope this video helps you out. Please click like, please click subscribe, and click on my name underneath this video for all my other how-to videos. Once again, guys, enjoy.